Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm Ian Genius and welcome to The Beast Inside, the new series we're going to give a shot. We're going to go ahead and hit new game. Uh, standard, sure. Loading. Little quick, real quick while this is loading up. Uh, if you pick up this game on Steam, there may be a couple issues getting it to run. I did find a fix online. Uh, if you want to link to that, if you decide to play this for yourself, so let me know down in the comments below and I will go ahead and paste that fix. Uh, it has to do with Intel 10th generation or higher uh, chipsets. So, you know, if you want to play this game and it keeps crashing after 30 seconds, let me know and I'll hook you up. Oh, yes, we are looking through plague. Where, where am I? Goggles. Why? God. Why? Oh. Adam! Adam! Adam's wearing goggles. Why are you stalking oh, us? Oh, Lord. Is this about Adam's work? What do you want from us? Why are you tormenting my family? Adam's no! dead. Adam! No, no, screaming ain't gonna work. No, no, what have you done to Adam? Oh, God. This is off to a... Uh... War calls for a casualty. No. No oh my god. Stop. It's a regular family. You hear me? We just wanted to live our life and you ruined everything. Pictures, bugs, threats. And now you kill me. Stay away. Don't. Somebody's going to get it. They already know about you. They've been watching the house. They won't let you. Hush. No. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, okay. Um one week earlier. Hopefully this this week earlier is a little better than the week we just saw. Of the past. President Carter had commented on the Russian threat that we oh, so we're way in the past. Trees. Sunlight. we go the more doubts i have yeah we're going in the middle of nowhere it will be challenging true but it was you who kept saying on. you'd like to get away from the city feel the call of the wild new the weekend get behind honey. this music not for the rest of our lives <laughs> who says it's this for the rest all of, of a car on really, these Emma? kind of roads we don't like, know the day or the hour <gasps> very funny like we don't hear enough about nuclear threats in the media mm. that's what i'm talking about if I don't break the code, this country would be like a basket full of nuclear mushrooms. Adam, stop it. Okay. But then again, maybe this shack will fall down on us before Brezhnev's boys launch their first missile. So, it's my no shack. Uh, code cracker? It's a present from your parents, and you should appreciate it. Take Boomers. Look. Oh, it looks even better than the photos. I wish my parents would give me a cabin in the woods. It's not even a cabin, it's a house. Well, our stuff made it here before us. And those huh. lazy movers didn't even bother waiting for us. That's okay. We can bring it all in ourselves. Yeah, meaning I toil away while you give orders from the shower. You have like three things if this over here is what I'm looking at. Huh. Three hour drive and we're finally here. The place huh, seems yes. peaceful. Micro cassettes. Maybe it'll help me to focus on those damn telegrams to decipher. Honey, don't just stand there. Those boxes won't carry themselves what in. What boxes? I'm seeing trash bags. Update. The place seems peaceful and quiet until Emma showed up. Okay, I'm looking for boxes? WSD, move around. Oh, those boxes. I'm just blind. Home sweet home. Tab to check the voice recorder. Adam uses the voice recorder to record conversations as thoughts. Cool. Gotta get those boxes inside. Okay. I should put the box on the table upstairs. Ooh. Uh, hey, why'd you shut the door on me? I'm carrying all this crap. Oh, I can run. There's a table upstairs. Table ups. What is that? A pull hook for lowering the attic stairs. 
Cool. I am looking for a table. This is a shelf. I don't... Moving service. I paid those bastards in advance, so of course I didn't even bother to take those boxes to the attic. You can't trust anyone these days. Err. So am I putting it... Am I putting it upstairs in the attic? That is a kind of neat picture. Kitchen. Kitchen cutlery is that that says. House is not finished. I'm gonna lose these boxes. I think this I'm already off to a terrible start. Ugh. Ah. Salmon. Thank God I can work remotely so now I don't have to set my alarm for 8 a.m. 6 a.m. I can tell time. Ooh. Zed is red. Adam, our dear son, this house belonged to our family for many decades, so we even called it the Stevenson's Refuge. Take good care of it. I don't know where I'm supposed to take the box. Oop. It's not a nightmare if it looks like one. A thinking woman's guide to pregnancy. Okay, um... Yeah! Oh, sweet. Let me just put that in the box. Excuse me. I have a bunch of boxes. I don't it's set upstairs. Is there anything back here? That's locked. This is the other half of this. Okay, we are locked. 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 Pipe wrench. Tools. Oh wow, I could just... Yeah. Give me that smoke. Anyway, we are going to try to figure out what to do with these boxes. So we can make progress. Upstairs table. Locked. Gotta be that. It's shining. It's, it, it's gotta be this. The box is where it should be. Time to paint the walls. I think there's some paint in the attic. What? I got the hook. Yeah! Look at me go! Man. You've gotta be kidding me. It's Fuck. locked. So, the baby hears everything? Even in the womb. So we will make a great agent, just like Dad. Honey, I can't get in the goddamn attic without a key. Stop That's swearing. The room. It should be in a drawer. Can I? She's brushing her teeth. I thought she was taking a shower. Okay, whatever. We are getting a key. This would be a great if there was one drawer. Great house if it was uh finished. Nope, nothing in here. I can't find it in the dining room. Oh, sorry. I, I guess I didn't get it from the trunk. Oh, <sighs> typical. Why did you tell me it was in there? Why do I die? <laughs> uh, yeah, look at me. Oh. Yeah. <clears throat> Sorry. We got a key. Oh, this box. It goes in the kitchen. Which I've seen a dining room, I haven't seen a kitchen yet. What kind of scary things are in the attic? Oh. Examine. Hidden message. Rotate. Oh. I wonder who they belong to, Grandma or someone else. Why was that a hidden message? Uh, yeah, we don't want to break it. This is creepy. An angel looks like a sleeping baby, but he might as well be dead, poor guy. Life has been rough on him. How long has he laid here? Probably like, for like a century. 
and there's a secret message. <laughs> Is it in the butt? Almost. Someone must have hit him really hard to make his legs fall off. Wait, is that blood or paint? Okay. Spray paint. Okay, we can't. What a creepy ad. I don't like addicts in general. And this addict goes higher. Aha. Crouch? I can't crouch. Found an axe. Huh. Save that for later. Deco. Books. Do do. Can I take fall damage? No. My guy is a cat. I thought there's supposed to be paint. There's paint. Damn it. Hmm, what's that? <laughs> a loose plank. Someone's hidden something under the floor. Uh, uh, come on! What could it be? A treasure? Hope it's not Great Grandpa's porn mags. Wow. It's got a cipher on it. Paint. Who would use paint that old in their house? Who? Take this. Who would use that old paint? Oh God. An excerpt from Julius Caesar's commentaries on the Gallic War. I remember for this from my Latin classes. Some letters look different than others. Let's find the hidden. That. <laughs> I'd have to be JC. a goddamn code breaker. To... Wait, isn't that what I do for a living? Julius Caesar's initials, but why would someone write that they are equal? J equals C, and it's M H P A O. J equals C. Right? M H P A O. M H P A O. I have to break the cipher to open the box. M A H. Wait, hold on. Examination model, you can perform additional interaction with certain objects. Oh. Uh, so, M is W. This device will help me decode the letters in the text. Yeah. So, W. No. Okay, what? All right, we're gonna grab our handy dandy notebook real quick, cause this is gonna take a little bit of thinking. Let's see, we have M H P A O J equals C. Okay. Now we're gonna go back to this and M and W is not a thing, so let's go to M here. Oh no. Oh, J equals C. This is how we line this up. So there, right? There's a C here. So it's like this. J to C. Right? So that makes M equal to F? Let's see if that works. Yes, okay, 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 okay. We got it, we got it, we got it, we got it, we are geniuses. We are geniuses. Okay. So because that lines up, that's F. And then we want H, which gives us A. And I'm sorry if that irks you that I didn't go all the way over. There you go, if that makes you happy. P is I. A is T. 
O is H. And now, we're going to go back to this. We got F. Please be an A. Yes. I. Yes. Faith. <laughs> Look at that. We are code breaking geniuses, everybody. Let's see what's in this box. A key. Sure. There's more stuff in this box. We got a notebook. Property of Nicholas. Grandpa's name was a Nicholas. It is September 27th in the year of our Lord, 1864. Evening, almost. All right, thank you all for checking out episode one of The Beast Inside. If there's any like weird clues or Easter eggs or something that I missed, leave me a comment down below. If you like what you see, consider giving me a thumbs up, subscribing to the channel. Anyway, I will see y'all in the next one.